Good morning, everybody, and welcome to episode 126 of Whoops, My Time at Porsche with uh, Tolina. Let's get going. Hi, Mint. How you doing? Oops, sorry. Man, I think I just about knocked that poor man down the stairs. Let's feed the babies. Hi, babies. I wonder if I can knock him out the door, too. That would be rude, wouldn't it? Yes, it would. Feed that baby. Out the door. We are going to go see... I don't know what we're going to see. We're going to see something. Oh, we might see more than we expected. No, no, we're good. All right, I have wheat growing. I have wheat ready to harvest. I put wheat in the ponies box. The pony's ecstatic anyway, but um, I think the wheat is probably helping. Selena, I've done a bunch of work. Check them out. Thank you, Mr. Ack. Let us remove two of those. They're worth 5,000 apiece. We are going to go sell them. We will grab our box. We will grab our thing. For the town hall. We have an important announcement at tonight's fireside meeting in Peach Plaza. Please try to make it 1900 sharp. Okay. Oh, we have another toy robot. We should give that to Petra. She loves those things. The other people who like them are Jack and uh, Toby. Speaking of who? Hello, Jack. I don't like those Hus and Tusk guys, but it's a shame what happened to them. Hello. Hi. Toby talks about Emily sometimes, and the girls make fun of him for it. Well, they're, they're, they're just rude little monsters, aren't they? You, however, you can have you like robots. You don't like robots? Man, give it back. I know someone who does. Molly, Polly, and Dolly. Hi, girls. Troublemakers. There's Higgins. Hey, Higgins. How are you doing? Spring is a good season for commissions. Actually, every season is a good for commissions, but the weather now is nicer, therefore making spring slightly superior. Higgins. Okay. That is, that is like one of the nicer phrases he's ever said. Let's give him a ruby. Not, not bad, Talina. I've been wanting one of these. Your powers of perception rival my own. Oh, sigh. They better ride with yours, buddy. You know what? I think Dawa might be up going to have a rendezvous with his girl. We might have to go drop him a crystal necklace and give her a chest of drawers. That's their favourite gift. Respectively, chest of drawers and necklace. Alright, let's just have a quick zoop. There's our first error. One. And our second error. There we are. Easy peasy, but it's easy. Let's go. One. Uh-oh, now it gets harder. Maybe, I mean, I could just turn it and find what I need. There we go, next we have that. Sneaky. There's something different here and I'm just not picking it. Um, it's possibly just my eyes playing tricks. Okay, there was something different there and I couldn't pick it, but it was there. So that was worth that was worth tapping. Sandrock. As I record this, I'm waiting for Sandrock. I'm, I'm desperately hoping to have this finished before it before Sandrock comes out. So um, that's what I'm doing. I'm also keeping up with my other two series. But um, so waiting on Sandrock. But I'd better focus. So I'm just not going to see what I need to see. Sometimes it's just like a little ripple. There it is. In the um, in the hardwood, you can generally just see it, kind of. It's it's pretty much invisible. You just yeah, it's but it's like a little dip. All right. I know. I'm a I'm a bit 
Let's go buy our kids their toys, because I keep forgetting to do it. And I think we can either spend today in the... Um, oh, we have to check and see if we've got any um, relic bits that we hadn't got before. So we might just very quickly go in here. Don't worry, we won't do any balloon shooting today. We'll just grab our toys that we can. Get. Sail. That way we're going to just build up our toys. I might spend this week building up toys. And um, next week we might see what they want. Hey, no, not, not you. Cancel. There we go. Confirm. Right. Django. Sandrock Yakmel Sausage. If I had a source for that stuff, I'd keep it a secret too. Yeah. Hello. Hi, how are you doing? I would just talk recipes with you. Sure, let's do golden salmon. Special salmon. <sighs> Mr. Django. So what we're going to do is work our way through all of the recipe variations. I could do this by doing it at the stove, but it's quicker just to let Mr. Yak Mr. Yakbell, Mr. <laughs> Mr. Django, um, you know, rip me off. Okay. Hey, Sam. So what we're going to do is we're going to run all the way out to the collapsed wasteland because I also have one last fish. So today we're going to go fishing. And tomorrow, if we have any spare time, we're going to go and um, go digging in the desert mines. And I think between between the two things, we should we should get everything done. So I know I don't feel like playing chicken with the birds again today, but I guess I guess we'll just have to. I'm still looking for December. Hi, birdie bird. If you don't start it, I won't finish it. Okay. See, sounded like a deal to me too. All right, should be able to find bladefish out here. So let's let's see if we can uh, catch ourselves a king bladefish to finish off the museum's collection. Okay, that's not a good start to the day. Okay, here we go. Wow, at least we're getting a good supply of catfish. I can sell them. Come, King Bladefish, send me not your catfish minions. This is the um, the best fishing round too, so if I'm making it look easy, it's it's because I've got a really fine fishing rod today. It's the one of the ones for the body. All these are really easy fish to catch. I don't know, it's one of the two. It's one of those things. Here's our first emperor cutfish. We've had our first emperor wise fish. So we're not really looking for wise fish, and we're not really looking for king catfish. We'll take either if we catch them, but um what we really want is our king blade fish. It's kind of cute, it's you know, a bit pink and a bit purple and a bit swirly. And... I know, I'm gonna catch it eventually. Higgins at the guild inspection either.
Alright, here's our first kingfish. Hopefully it's not our last kingfish. Even with a good fishing rod, these things are a little bit fun to catch. Catfish kings aren't too bad. Let's see if we can catch another kingfish. That'd be nice. So there, our, our day of fishing just paid for itself. pretty down here. All I want to do is get in a boat or something and go and explore the buildings and just see what's inside there. I know I'm playing a little bit fast and loose now with the um, with fish. Eventually we'll get a kingfish bite. I think if, um, if I remember rightly, um, Yelin had a lot of trouble with this particular fish. Mind you, I think Yelin stayed up all night catching it and then went to the fishing contest and caught two or three the next day and wasn't, wasn't a very happy bunny. Oh dear, which reminds me, we should get a gift together too. And isn't there a, um, isn't there an announcement? Or something in the square tonight. We better maybe we have to head back. We might. There, there it is. All right, last fish. No, Yelen. I mean, Talina. What are you doing? Right. Come on, time to go. We've got a, an announcement at the, the town square thing. We should probably go see what that's about. I know, we're going to run the gauntlets of the big pink pooping birds that we, I think we've, ah, promised Toadie we won't hurt them. Ah, that was very silly of us, because I, I think the birds aren't at all worried about hurting us. That, that poop in the back of the head is like a brick. Oops, we're late for our fireside, we've got to hoof it if we can. We can take the shortcut, we'll just kind of run through the park or something. We're not that late, maybe. Alright. Good evening everyone, thank you all for coming. As we all know, Porsche is an open and inclusive place. Anyone who wants to join us, as long as the conditions are met, will be very welcome to do so. It's not possible for everyone to be the best or brightest, or in some cases anywhere near close to either. <laughs> Nevertheless, we're all valued members of the community. We all work hard and support each other whenever possible. That's the true meaning of being a Porsche. Some people may remember Huss and Tuss as crooks, vandals, extortionists, fraudsters, liars, schemers, no good mix, poor hygienists, among other such titles. Today, however, we think of them not as all those things, but as chili makers. Portia is a city of second chances, and we are a people of forgiveness, not of grudge. And how could we hold a grudge against two young men who even wanted to do a surprise chili cookout for the town? In light of Huss and Tuss's recent good behaviour on behalf of the Mayor's Office of Borsha, I hereby officially welcome Huss and Tuss as citizens of Borsha. Yay! <laughs> See, one of them's like, yay, clap more. As a welcome gift, we intend to have their old burned down house renovated and rebuilt by the ANG Construction Co, overseen by none other than your our very own Higgins. In addition, Huss and Tuss will be given jobs down by the harbour to assist with cargo and trade so that they may make an honest living. As good citizens of Porsche, please make Huss and Tuss feel as welcome as any other citizen, and please help them in any way you can. That concludes tonight's fireside chat. Good night, everyone. Oh boy. Django. More citizens means more customers. Ah, uh, talk to Martha. Those two guys are alright. They've been coming down my shop to help lately. I didn't know the Huss and Tuss brothers were living like that. I should have baked them some bread if they'd asked. Ah, uh, let's go talk to Mars. These guys, eh? Just as long as we can keep them away from the children. <laughs> Great. Remy. 
We're still looking into the sausage bag. Could have been how the sausage bag could have been so damaging. We're ruling it a critical hit. We're going to do something good for us and Tuss. We just have to. We don't. You know, I'm actually kind of proud of these two. They've come a long way. We didn't find Bandit Logan, but we did shine a light on a situation that needed attention. This is very true. Oh, let's grab Higgy. Hey Higgins, can I help you? Yes, yes, applaud for Higgins. <laughs> oh man, that guy, he's so modest. Not. Oh dear. Alright, there's a couple of arrows up this way. I wanted to catch Martha and Mars um, before they went to bed, so. In here? Maybe? I know there's a bunch more. Okay, not in here. Oh, sigh. Alright, wait a minute. There is, there is like an arrow. Maybe if I run fast enough I can catch it. Wait, 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 it's gone this way. Is that, um... Alright, it looks like... I didn't think I caught all of that many people, but okay. Hey, Emily! More new neighbours. I really love how bustling our town is becoming. It's so sad what's happened with these two weird guys. Weird brother guys. If I'd known they were having trouble getting by, I could have hired them to help out with chores. This is true. Alright, is there anyone else I might have missed? No. Alright, we're good. See, I really hope Ginger likes my, my farm, because hopefully the pretty lights will make her happy. Anyway. I know, right? I know. Hopeless romantic. Which reminds me, I have that book for her. I just can't remember if I have it in the museum as well. Let's um, let's grab the piggy. We are going to finish out our day attempting to catch the rare and annoying uh, thingamie what's it kingfish. I can't just fly over the wall here if I remember right. Now I'm going to have to go all the way down to here. Did I remember to get the chest off the gate? I did. Let's just fly over the gate. There we go. Oops. I don't feel like going for a swim. Can we ram raid the boops? We can ram raid the bird. I don't think he liked that very much. I don't blame him really. One angry pine cop because I ran into him with the piggy. On purpose. Ah, oh, yeah, I did not do that. Let's go fishing and see if we can catch ourselves a king squiggly fish, banner, banner fish, blade fish, a king blade fish. So it's a little bit past midnight and I, if I remember I spent a good two or three days last time trying to catch this jolly fish. So what we're going to do, as I said, is we're going to alternate. We're going to do uh, fishing tonight, mining tomorrow if nothing exciting comes up. And maybe a little bit of mining if we can squish it in after. And that'll be about it. really really like to find out what's happened to um, Arden because it's kind of like he's really he's a really missing factor in the town it's like an unfinished story I'd like to know the end of Arden's story or at least where he went off to you know did he live happily ever after did he go to Sandrock to visit did he end up I don't know joining the traveling musician band the Rogue Knight's not gone either, you know, he's, he's still there, um, and we never know where he went, 
Is he causing someone else problems? Looks like it's King Catfish Day today. Um, you know, so there are there are questions that I have I have questions, story questions that I would really like to see answered. But I I don't think have been yet. So I'm looking forward to seeing what Pathia does with with the story parts, the last little bits of story in Portia that that we haven't seen haven't seen a proper finish to. Um and I, I'd li I mean, I don't mind if it ends up going across several, if you get clues to it across several games or DLCs, that's fine too, but just as long as we get the end. And there we go. So we are going to go and do another day in Portia with Talina and see what the day brings. Like I said, we're in the end, in the very end part of the game. And I was supposed to see what relics I had. Let's um let's feed the baby. And feed the other baby. Jordan and Rowan. Rohan or Rohan. You can't let speak. Alright. Oh, this is a day for mining. I'm so glad I went fishing yesterday. And it's Monday. Let's go see what's in the letterbox. From the town hall. Dear yes, Selena, I hope all's well. A few things you might have missed at yesterday's fireside. Hey, I was there. We've decided to take in the Huss and Tuss brothers as official members of the Porsche family and give them jobs down by the harbour. We've also decided to fix up an old house and give it to them. Gail. P.S. We have we gave the job of rebuilding the house to Higgins. Yeah, no worries. Man, there's more than one of them in town. Dear Citizen, the annual Porsche Fishing Day is happening this Friday and Saturday. If you are interested in participating, bring your patience and a fishing rod and register at the town event. Sure. Hi Selena, I made some I had some extra herbs, so I made a few medicines for you. It's always good to carry more medicine. <laughs> Thanks, Doc. Dear Builder, thank you for your exemplary effort in discovering product issues in yesterday's inspection. You truly have the skills of a top tier builder. It's a little something for your time. Thanks, Commerce Guild. Alright, let's see if this. Nope, no more letters. Okay. Let us head into town. Think about it. Firstly, to get out of this with less of rain, but secondly, because we do need that commission. That's kind of important. What? What? Oh man, I just put my sword on my back. Why am I not waving my fishing rod around like a lunatic? I'm doing my best, you better be doing yours. Sure thing, Piggy, but I'm here first. And that double S is mine. Haha. -ha. It's a water wheel. I don't know if I was a bit creepy grabbing that one. Let us go check it out. Okay. Let's go build our water wheel. I'm not sure about building tall structures. Oh, what else are we going to build? We're going to go make ourselves some tires as well. I'm not so sure about building tall structures in this kind of weather, but hey, you know how it is. Looks like the boys have been to work already. Let's do a... I will have all of those things. I have a very full backpack. Sort of stuff. Who's that? Alright, I'm going to leave that thing. Let me just... I already know the back thing. Okay, so we can sell that one, that'll be fine. And I accidentally put my sword back in my back. What you get when you hit the R button too soon. Just pull that back out of there, pop it down. Alright, what can I get out of here? You know, I'm just going to drop these chips away. I'm going to drop that away. I'm going to drop that away. Oh, and a box. That's pretty much it. I need to go donate that thing to the museum. And we probably should sell our fish. Let's drop the pillows in the box as well, and the, the snore masks. That's pretty good. We can sell those. 
500 creative designs. Yeah, it's been below cost. You know what? Let's let's throw the sugar in the um, in here. That way the boys can just leave it alone. Alright, now we've got a little bit more space, we should be good. If we we're going to build ourselves a water wheel, if we had all the ingredients, let's go check it out. I don't know if I can. Ooh, I can build three of them. Wow, no, let's, let's just build the one. It's so nice to be able to just build. You know, oh wow, it's a water wheel, I'll build it right now. It's like, when we first started, it was like, oh my god, it's a water wheel. How are we ever going to get that done? You know, and now it's like, yeah, we can do it. It's easy. I oh, know, I, I am, yes, I am going to stand in the rain watching my, my factory do, do its job. Okay. Look at that. This thing is magic. And then we're going to go mining, because I don't see any any missions or any interesting things happening. So we're going to go and mine and see if we can really catch the... Um... Hi Mint, how you doing? Um, to see if we can catch the... Actually that's what we had this on. Relics. Let's sort all, see if we have any duplicates. Now we just go for a quick squeeze through here. Look at this, we did. We got three whole pieces that we didn't get before. That is good. Alrighty, so we got the bottom of the summer doll. Right, so now we just need autumn and winter. We got lion piece number two. So lion is now complete. So all we need is, oh wait, we, we do need plain model piece, piece two. Oh, I think I saw that yesterday too. Alright, we wanted this one, there we go, because that is clay figure piece 1, piece 2, piece 3, so we've got all of those. Alright, so now we just need plain model piece 2, sphere trophy piece 3, autumn doll piece 2, and winter doll piece 2. Once we've done that, I'm pretty sure we've got all of the relics out of the desert ruins. So that, that is, we are so going to get that done. Alright, and now we've got plenty of space to hunt for it into. So, okay, we need to go back to where we saw the plane models and get plane model piece two, was it? Piece two, of course it was. So piece, all of these are piece twos except for the, the sphere, which is piece three, and that should be interesting to find. Let's go. Let's uh, rock and roll our piggy out. Is Antoine, Antoine's over on the, oh, he's not on the other side of town. No, he looks like he's heading into the museum, maybe. Is it Antoine I'm chasing? Oh no, it's Remy. Hey Remy! Hello! I've got your commerce commission. No worries, I will do that for you. Alrighty. Now it's time for the ruins. I know, I did the same thing as I did last time. Mind you, last time I just flew the pig out, it wasn't a problem, and I'm not sure I should be flying this high up in the sky in this sort of weather. Apart from the fact it's cold and wet and windy, and, you know, the saddle's probably slippery. Um, there's lightning. And I'm riding a metal pig. Awesome. Alright, let's get out of this weather. We are going to go and find ourselves an aeroplane model piece two. Summer Doll Piece 2, Winter Doll Piece 2, and Autumn Doll Piece 2, sorry, and Winter Doll Piece 2, and Sphere Trophy Piece 3. And we're not going to find anything if I don't turn my hat on. Alright, so basically the plane bits were over in this direction. Let's, um, let's just go straight through. I know. It's crude, but effective. Hi, oh, there's a wall. I need to get through it. Fenced engine, fan model, pieces 2 and 2. Fortune cat, piece 3. No. Sailboat model, piece 1. Plane model, piece 4. I 
and maybe it was just piece four I saw. See, now I'm disappointed. I was excited for it. Okay, there we go. Okay, so why don't we just try and be a little bit more logical and organized? What? What am I speaking? This looks like a really good cluster to start on though. Why don't we... Why don't we... I know. Let's just start right here. And we'll just dig down at, a, at an angle. There we go. I don't know what we're going to use them for. I should probably get to talk to Paula too. I vaguely remember needing to talk to Paula. Let's grab that one over here. Okay, just come out from a slightly less angle. It's really hard to get them over your head like that. Alright, now we can. Bing, bada, boom. Let's do a bit of a. So, wow, we are in the middle of a treasure field. I love it. 24, 29, 34, 24. I know, there's just too many bits of treasure. Let's um let's start with this one. And we'll work our way down. The park will be here. And we're done. Let's go this way. And we're done. All right. Okay, that red button looks like it's skipping through the. Uh, the bushes. Let's see what else we've got in this area that's not so close. I guess we could start with that. Alright, let's just go with this. I know, I get this feeling of looks behind you. It's a bit disparate at times too. Oops, where to go? There it is. And we've got that one. Let's head over. Put this bog deep through the aluminium. A little bit of extra bits and bobs on the way through is always good. So I'm mining by opportunity. I mean I could, if I needed it, I could just stop and mine out the entire scene, but it's a pretty big scene. Let's see what else is in this vicinity. Okay, there's a few things fairly close. Autumn Doll Piece 1 is over there. Now we just need to find Autumn Doll Piece 2. Alright, that's the closest bit. Let's just do that bit off. And then we'll do this for now. And then we'll do a scan. See if there's anything real close. Well, nothing really. Oh, 
All right, let's just grab these. These look like they're my closest bets. So we'll grab these and get them out of the way. This one. And grab that one. What? Oh, fine, I'll eat my stamina. We should, if we just keep digging, we should be able to dig that all up. That. I have condensed pastone. I have a few of them, but hey, you never know your luck in Big City. Alright, let's just do a scan. Ooh. Alright, let's go over to the Autumn Doll Piece one. And the grounds that may be Autumn Doll Piece to is lurking somewhere in the garden. out a bit further. Some things will come into a view that weren't there before. Bonsai piece, fan model piece. Alright, let's just go for that. And we'll just we'll just keep pretty close and see what else is real close. See there's a few more things that came up one time. Just dig it this way. So we, we took out three of our seven pieces last time and I think now the rest are going to just be a bit of a slog. But I mean, we've, we've already had one slog and we survived it. Alright, whatever that is. That's really close, we might as well grab it. And see if there's anything else that comes up. No, oh, I have a cluster. Let's go for the cluster. Alright. Straight in. No mucking around. Alright, do a bit of a scan, see if there's anything else that comes up. So there's a few new, well, wow, there's a lot of new points. Let's, let's start here. And we'll just go for something that looks promising. Clay figure. Sailboat, fan model, fan model, silicon chip, clay. Male point figure, sculpted line for one set piece. All right, you know what? I really like that cluster there, but I think we can probably do better if we grab. Wow, they're just about as far away, aren't they? All right, we're going to go for these. Let's take these ones out. That's closer. I mean, we can do with the special, the, the secondary pieces anyway. That's closer. I know. I just feel like I'm going back and forward. Stone bonsai piece. We might go for that because it's there. Marco's tail database, Marco's tail fan model. Keypad tempering liquid sailboat. Fan model sailboat, fan model. Autumn doll piece one. Yeah, but I want piece two. Alright, let's go for this close piece here. And then we'll zip around and we might go for that bonsai piece. If we can get to it, that'd be nice. Alright, we're right in the corner. Let's just see what we get in this. Ooh, what's that? Parts box. Okay, I might go for that autumn doll piece on the grounds that I'm after piece two. However, knowing my luck, it may just mean that autumn doll piece two is right on the other side of the uh, of the ruin. And I'm right underneath the bar, and I'm never going to 
get to if I go to sleep. Then again, we, we could we could lock out in a big city. Uh oh, I think I went to sleep. Maybe no, I ran out of energy. Alrighty, so on that note, I think I might bid you all good night. Maybe, yeah, we're not going to eat anything. That would be a waste. And we'll end the episode here. And next episode, we'll do some more. So thanks for hanging with me, guys. And I will check you later. Take care out there.